Good morning, East Alabama and West Georgia. This is Kevin Moon from God's Country. It's time for your primetime forecast on Dr. Don's weather. Now, here's my friend, Dr. Don. Hey, here, East Alabama and West Georgia. Welcome to your Friday. We have made it through another work week. It is time now for your primetime forecast from the Alpha Weather Center. Jamie Dukas, your local Alpha agent. Give him a call at 256-831-7770 or follow that link at the top of this video to get a no-obligation, cost-free insurance quote jamie could save you a ton of money doesn't cost you a dime to find out and also your name goes into a hat for a drawing that we hold every two weeks we give away a free copy of the dr don weather app you also get a car air freshener and we have other goodies that will be announced pretty soon probably tomorrow morning here on dr don's weather we're going to be giving away gift certificates we have rodeo tickets and you can become eligible to win all of that by simply asking for a no obligation insurance quote from jamie Ducas at alpha insurance be sure you get that done today And look, when your name goes in the hat, it stays there until you win. So you can't beat that deal. Let's take a look at your Storm Prediction Center convective outlook for today. All of those showers and thunderstorms that we dealt with last night moving on off to the eastern seaboard. We're expecting just general scattered thunder today across extreme southeast Alabama, north Florida, southern Georgia, and across the Atlantic coastal regions of South Carolina, North Carolina, and up into the Virginias. Not really really anticipating anything severe over there today. Uh, Yesterday's event played out pretty much exactly like we expected. We had an enhanced risk of severe weather across West Alabama, slight risk across Central Alabama. We did see several thunderstorms go tornadic yesterday afternoon, uh, causing some problems in West Alabama, then up across uh, the uh, Tuscaloosa area and into Birmingham Metro. We saw a couple of tornadoes there. Uh, And then as the storms got into East Alabama, they started losing some of their intensity. They were weakening. And even though those storms packed a pretty good punch when they came through East Alabama, they were below severe limits and we did not have uh, any damage that we're aware of across the region. So uh, yesterday's forecast held up pretty good across the area. And we go back to mostly sunny skies today. Tomorrow we see uh, no thunderstorm activity across the region. And then as we take a look at Sunday, we'll begin to watch out to our west, uh, not expecting anything severe, but maybe a few rumbles of thunder over in West Alabama, back into Mississippi, Southern Arkansas, Louisiana, and Texas on Sunday. That will be our next storm system that comes in here Sunday night into Monday, and I'm awfully afraid next week looks wet. Uh, We've got a chance of rain pretty much every day next week and we may have periods of thunder to deal with Uh, right now i don't see anything that suggests a major severe weather outbreak just a lot of rain that'll be possible next week across east alabama and west georgia this afternoon sunny and cool about 20 degrees cooler today versus what we saw yesterday but lots of sunshine 51 this afternoon in roanoke we'll go to 48 in ashland 49 in lineville we dowie tops out at 50 48 up in ranburn pine mountain goes to 54 this afternoon and rockford will top out at 51 degrees don't forget about our fast forecast on instagram it's your forecast in 60 seconds or less from Dr. Don's Weather. Here's your six-day forecast from the Alpha Weather Center. Jamie Dukas, your local Alpha agent. Back to sunshine today, 51 this afternoon. We'll dip down to around 29 tonight, uh, so maybe uh, one more night where you could have a bonfire or build a fire in that fireplace. Uh, Those nights are going to start to get fewer and, and far between as we head into the latter part of February and into March. Saturday, mostly sunny, 50 one will warm up into the low 60s on Sunday under sunny skies and then here comes that pattern change on Monday 80% chance of rain showers 61 will be your high down to 53 Monday night with a 70% chance of rain 60% chance of rain on Tuesday 72 60% chance of rain Tuesday night down to 60. Yeah, look at Wednesday, a 60% chance of rain. High temperature around 73. 
and the medium range forecast, uh, the medium range models taking us on into the rest of next week. I got to tell you, rain looks like uh, it's going to be likely on Thursday, Friday, and maybe on into next weekend. So a wet period ahead across East Alabama and West Georgia. Southern Union State Community College Live Doppler HD radar scanning from Peachtree City, Georgia this morning, showing no precipitation across East Alabama or West Georgia. Follow us over on Twitter. That handle is DSTREN1040. We broadcast all of our weather information on Twitter, just as we do on Facebook, YouTube, and at drdonwx.com, where you can support Dr. Don's weather by clicking on that donate button. Don't forget, you can catch my daily weather forecast over on God's Country and the Classic. You can listen to them online by clicking on the More button. Scroll down to the God's Country page, download the Mixler app, and you can listen to God's Country anywhere in the whole wide world. Thanks to those folks you see scrolling on the screen, we can bring you our weather forecast every single day. So we ask that you support those businesses made in the South in Roanoke. Also, uh, all those fine folks uh, continue to support us, so please support them so they can continue to help us. Anchor Roofing, Joey Knight can give you uh, free inspections. He's a good, honest guy and will take care of you if you have any roofing needs. If you own a business and would like to be a partner here in Dr. Don's Weather, just send us a message on Messenger and we can have you started by the time we do our next forecast, which will be first thing tomorrow morning. Good Lord willing and the creek don't rise. We'll see you then. Y'all have a fantastic Friday. Bye now.